up guys over of here today we're going to be talking about nibiru incentivized testnet what it is and how we can participate first of all what is nibiru it's an l1 d high hub build on top of cosmos l0 the project is currently on a testnet and the main net is scheduled to launch at some time during the summer as far as i understand team is building a lot of DeFi products within that hub but the main focus is currently on perpetuals also with noting that project had a funding round of 8.5 million and they're gonna be another funding round before the launch of the mainnet and as usual all links gonna be in description 60 percent of the tokens are allocated for the community and some of that amount will be allocated as rewards to incentivize testnet participants the rewards gonna be native tokens some stables and potentially some nfts and there will be specifics for the claiming process first of all there may be a vesting period for the tokens second there will be a kyc now it's unclear whether or not they will be using like some kyc provider or do them do it themselves i haven't found the concrete information on that yet maybe it hasn't been decided yet i don't know but there will be a kyc for sure when you're going to be claiming your rewards and then we have some country restrictions first of all u.s citizens as we can see in tos Persons or entities who reside in are citizens of, are located in, are incorporated in, or have registered offices in the United States of America are prohibited from using the services. And there are also restrictions on some territories. You should not be a resident, national, or agent of the Crimea region, Cuba, Iran, North Korea, Syria, or any other country to which the United States or United Kingdom or the European Union embargoes goods or imposes similar sanctions so how does this work every phase has the tasks you complete this task and you get the points and then the amount of your rewards when you're going to claim them is going to be dependent on the number of points that you acquire there are four phases of incentivized test nets phase one is oracles and staking phase two is governance phase three liquidity application perps and spot and phase four is going to be trading competition we're currently in phase two but based on the information on social media you can still do phase one tasks and what are the tasks for example for phase one we have delegators you need to stake you need to run full node and become a validator for the second phase we got governance tasks and we need to deploy smart contract so some minimum technical skill required there are guides on discord that you can follow but obviously then i gonna magically do everything for you you need to have a minimum understanding of how things work okay so how do we get into incentivized testnet program there is a form on gleam and to enter first of all you need to do all the social tasks here and while doing that you will pass your discord id your wallet address and for wallet i recommend using kepler obviously you will need to add the network to be able uh, to get your wallet address there are two ways of doing that first of all you can pull that manually from the docs but more convenient way you can enter the app click any page like the faucet for example and then if you connect your wallet it will suggest you to add the network so you add this network and you got your wallet address then you copy that and you paste that here also as far as i understand doing all of these activities like all these points they are gonna contribute to your overall amount of points then to do the tasks you obviously need to have some uh, testnet tokens in your wallet you can use this faucet on the website it's usable every six hours and then once per day you can use this faucet on the discord now some actions are doable through the interface panel and as far as i understand in order to do those actions through the interface you need to connect your wallet through one of the explorers this is a very simple process however not all explorers are working properly for example this one uh, on nibiru 5 for me it's not working in terms of i cannot for some reason connect my wallet properly so i cannot do any actions this is the explorer that kind of works for me for doing some tasks and i'll just show it as an example you can just follow the link on description to get to this page and we need to connect the wallet uh, here make sure it's kepler and we we'll click next here you select nibiru testnet you can put any name here i can put test one then you click key make sure this is the address of your wallet that you created with the kepler then you click save and there you go you connected it now for example if we go to staking for me personally this explorer only worked uh, for delegating 
and then all of the other actions like withdrawal, uh, ready allegation, claiming rewards, for me that it doesn't work. And again, I'm not tech savvy, so I don't know, maybe there are other ways to do that via the interface. But in general, if you want to participate in incentivized testnet and get the maximum amount of points, you will have to do the most by console commands either way. There is a ton of information on the blog, uh, on Discord, so be sure to check that. I'll try to set up everything properly and like make a guide, but there is no guarantee that I will succeed in that because I'm pretty bad on technical stuff. Either way, that's all I wanted to cover in this video. If you found it helpful, please drop a like, consider subscribing, and I'll see you soon.